Hello everyone and welcome back to Dinkum. We got a trophy. A gold trophy from Julia. Uh, where do we put it? I don't know. Guess we'll put it on top of the cabinet here. Uh, that's our second trophy. So next time, I'm going to try to go for the silver trophy. I want to collect them all. Um, now, let's pick up these signs here. As cool as they are. Uh, I don't think I want them there right now. Um, today, I'm going to try to... I'm going to move this house. So let's go to Fletch. And we have no, yeah, no need to make donations. Okay. Uh, let's talk about the town. I want to move a building. Guest house. Move it. Now I'm going to put it like right here. So we need to move all this stuff, pick it up, pick up the furnace, pick up the grinder, the grain mill, all of it. And we're going to relocate this. Where do I want? Where do I want the windmill? Um, oh, the furnace is windmill compatible. Oh, so is the barbecue. Okay, then. Interesting. Okay, I probably want them over here then next to, well, first of all, let's move the lamp, the doghouse. Let's see, do we have a, yeah, let's uh, put the dog kennel there. the lamp. table, cooking table. We're just going to dump this stuff right here for now. Oh, we got to empty out our garbage. Um, I think we can do that later. Take the statue. There we go. That's all moved over. All right, 
I'm going to have to move over these boxes too, which is going to be kind of a pain. All right, let's see. Let's take the house deed. Whoops. We can just put it there. That would be a good spot for it. Uh, let's get out our dirt printer here. Or I could put it next to the house here. Put a couple tiles over. I'm kind of undecided. I think this would be okay. No. First... Uh, we're gonna, I think, pave the ground. Mossy brick path. That'd be interesting. Rock edge path. Maybe we'll, uh, we'll try that. Okay, so how big is it? Five, five by five. Yeah, that seems okay. I just want to try a different um, type of flooring underneath before I place it down. Uh, I'm going to need more of that. Did I use rock path or rock edge path? Rock edge path. Okay. Yeah, that'll be fine. Do it. That's going to be my workshop. Now for a little landscaping. Now I can't move these kegs and the beehives yet. I want to wait until they're um, finished with their current job. After they're ready to harvest, I'll harvest them and then I'll move them somewhere else. Um, but basically I want I 
think I want my windmill up here. Or over here. Maybe over here will be the beehives and the kegs and all that. Oops. I know it looks like a mess now. It's going to look like that for a couple of days as I'm uh, moving stuff around. I kind of wish I had put uh, some kind of tile underneath this house before I moved it. Now it's just dirt. I, I wish I would have put grass. Now I can still do that, but I'd have to move it somewhere else and then move it back. So that's like 50,000 just to get some tiles under it, which I will do. Because I got money. Might as well spend it. Alright, um, let's see. Where do I want the windmill? I guess up here because the, the crops are here. And I use the windmill uh, to process crops through the grinder. And cooking things and meals and whatnot. All right, this is a silly question, but the windmill has to be outside, right? Yes, I can't put it inside. Okay. And that totally makes sense, but uh, I just wanted to make sure. Which way do we want the windmill facing? No, not that way. Oh, it'll only face to the west? Okay. Well, all right then. Yeah, I'd prefer it to face uh, the same direction as my front door is facing. Basically, south would be great. But that's all right. All right. Um... Well, it looks like all this stuff does use the windmill, so... Two furnaces. Two barbecues. Two grinders. Three grain mills. Hmm. Now that I think about it, let's put down some cement paths and Uh, just cement paths. 
What other options do we have for paths? Cement and do we have like a a brick path? Okay. I don't want to use that. I'm using that for roads. I could use the honeycomb. Basically what I'm trying to do. Is I want to put pathing here. All right, just sort of, just to sort of um, designate this area. as a crafting area of a sort. Boom, grain mill. Let's take those furnaces. Fill them up. There we go. Now our workshop in here will have all of our crafting tables, all of this stuff. Um, our cooking table. Maybe we could have that outside. Let's see, are these pretty well organized? Yeah. That's pretty much how I want them. Except we've got fertilizer in both of these. I don't want that. Um, this thing should go somewhere else. Uh, the char charging station as well. just gonna put that there for now and I'm gonna put my dirt printer in there now the quarry I think it needs space around it it'd be better if it had all sides of it clear so that it's free to uh pull ores. I think it can pull ores. I saw two ores next to it today, so I think uh, if it pulls one ore from the ground, it'll just keep pulling them until all the space around it is filled. Um, okay. So... What do I want to do with my cooking station? Do I want that in my workshop with all my food? I could just put it right up next to the um, the workshop here. I'll have my grills on this side, my cooking station here. All right, where is I should have some. Unused crates. There we go. All 
All right, I got to empty out some of my inventory here. Because I got to transfer a lot of stuff. Okay, vegetables and fruit. Goes here. Watermelon. If only I could get into it. I have no idea what that means. All oh, right, animal products. Goes here. Perfect. And finished goods. Let's uh, move this stuff around. Make it easier to transfer. Finished goods goes here at the end. Perfect and amazing. my um some of my paths here I don't need to hang on to those right now all right sorry I had to take a little break there for a moment I'm back and I completely forgot what I was doing Um, one thing I should do before it gets too late, I should do my daily milestones. So, uh, let's do that real quick. I gotta collect some seashells. Look at that yellow brick road. That's my fence showcase and my path showcase. I just put them down just so I could see what they look like. I really like the copper top fence. I'm going to use that for something. I can destroy this sign post here for some treasure, I think, but I'm going to leave it there. It's been there since the start of the game. And, uh, I don't know, I just kind of like it there. All 
Alright, we gotta bust some rocks. There's a crocodile. Here we go, let's use the chainsaw. There we go. There's one daily. Now we need a, a few more uh, shells here. Can we find any? see any over there. Alright, let's go. What is that thing? Sea urchin. There's another daily. Here we go. Boom. All right, we did our dailies. We did a little bit of reorganization. And now that we moved our workshop, our quote-unquote workshop house, uh, we can use a house customization kit and kind of make it look more like a workshop and less like a suburban home. That croc is still there. Let's go say hi. Oh. Alright, and tomorrow we can sell these shells. I don't need them. I don't want them. Let's put our treasures away. Where would I put my treasures? There we go. It's going to take me a little while to get accustomed 
to uh, where everything is now. Purple Sea Urchin. Did I give that to Theo? Yeah, he's not in here. I'll try tomorrow. I think I did. Okay, and this stuff, the dumpster... Um... Yeah, I want the dumpster... Up by my house here. I want to redo the flooring, though. Uh, let me see. What kind of seeds do I have? Can I just put grass seeds? Fern. Grass. Fur grass. Tropical grass. Yeah, see, it looks uh, it looks a bit strange here with um, the dirt floor under the house, and then coming out here is the grass. So I think I am gonna have to um, move the house, and then put grass under it, and then move it back. Hi, Fletch. Hi, Steve. Um, how big is this thing? It's a uh, one by two tiles? Okay. Let's move this thing over. Okay, that'll be fine. It might actually be better behind our house, but I'd like to have it sitting um, along alongside the uh, recharge station on top of a wood uh, floor. Alright, I think that's okay. I'm just playing around with different things, seeing what works, what doesn't. But, I think this will be... Okay. Oh boy. I'm about to pass out. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna pass out. I'm gonna sell all of this stuff. Camo boots? Oh, those don't look too bad. I'll keep those. Where's my clothing? Oh, it's in the cabinet. Right. 
a ninja shirt. I've got two detective pants. Um, what was I wearing? I was wearing the yellow boots, right? I'll keep the yellow boots. Uh, the camo boots. I will store that. Okay, and the rest of this stuff, I'll sell it. And I'll sell the shells tomorrow. Oh boy. We're about to pass out. Here it goes. Oh no. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, crud. I think I killed one of my eggs. What I meant to do is this. How many shards did we get? Three? Goodbye, B. Okay. Is that gonna be enough? Two shards. Uh, no, I think we need six to go to the deep, deep mines. Okay, so we'll have to make another mining expedition, get more rubies. Alright, well, it's late. We gotta go to bed. Not too exciting, but we got some, um, some work done. We got our workshop moved over. Dinks earned zero. And today, I think I'm going to take a break from just moving stuff around. And uh, we'll visit Sally. Maybe go into the mines. We can customize our house, too. Make it look more like a proper workshop. Then move our uh, furniture inside. Yeah, there's a lot of things we could do today. But, um... Things are looking good. We're making progress. Pretty soon we'll get this stuff organized. In a way that makes sense. We won't have so much garbage here laying around. I should just break these open and do something with the with the bees nests. 